Hey guys, so today we're going to be minimizing the diaper bag, book bag. This is just a regular old book bag that I got off of Amazon or something. Um, it's called Geisen. So yeah, we're going to be going through this guy and taking some stuff out and rearranging things because I'm going to call Aaron 99% potty trained. So <laughs> we're going to be minimizing things, taking out diapers and things we don't need because both of my babies are wearing underpants like big boys. So let's hop right in. So let's go through some side pockets right off the bat. Nothing in there. In here we have sunscreen. That's something we do need to keep because it's summertime and the boys need to be protected sometimes. Sunglasses, Aaron loves his sunglasses so we're keeping those. Here are some masks. I think it's just the boys masks in here that my mom made for them. We don't like ever go out, but I do want to keep those just in case. Also have some hand sanitizer spray. I find the spray is really easy for the kiddos. Like we'll take it to like the playground and I'll just spray them before we go on the playground and spray them after we get off the playground. And I think it's really nice. This is a bigger bottle than the one I had before, but it's okay. Way down in here, what do we have, what do we have? We have some Walmart bags, which I used to use as like emergency diaper bags, like wet bags. I have a couple stickers from the last time we went to the doctor actually, so I'll have to give those to the boys. <laughs> and then I also have some uh, antibacterial hand wipes in there because you guys know the world we're living in right now. So I'm gonna keep all of that stuff on the keep side. In front here, I do have one of these strawberry shaped um, little reusable grocery bags that I can keep on hand just in case we happen to go to the store and we're not prepared with, you know, our own reusable bags. So let's go to the front pocket. Pocket. This is like the me pocket mostly. So I do have an extra pair of sunglasses because I like to have one with me just in case I forget my own. There's a little tiny airplane. I'm going to keep that. It's going to stay in the keep pile. <laughs> I've got some Excedrin because I can't function without headache medication. <laughs> Here are some little uh, tissues just in case. We've got, oh, a really, really squished Lara bar. I'm actually going to put that in the take back downstairs category. <laughs> and I have a pen. You never know when you need a pen, right? Uh, a chapstick and the little button off of my buttons thingy that always falls off. So I'm gonna put that back in there. I have a feeling we're not gonna get rid of many things. So we'll see. Okay, we're in this bottom front pocket here. So I actually do have a handful of disposable diapers. We used these when we took our vacation to Tennessee last fall and now I don't know what I'm gonna do with them. <laughs> I might just save them. I really don't know what I'm gonna do with them. Uh, we might use them for overnight or something because um, Aaron's probably gonna grow out of them here soon. I don't know what else we're gonna do with those. I hope these three are the only ones that I have left in the house. Here's a little wet bag. I don't feel like we need extra wet bags. I feel like there's gonna be some more in there so we'll go through those when we get to it. This was the hand sanitizer spray that I was using before. This is the Honest Company one and it's only like this full so that's why I got that new one from Olivia Care. You can see it's like massive compared to the Honest Company one though. I do have a little like set of like activity books for the boys. It's just like I just have like a little book they can read in there, a pack of crayons, and then this is like a little like coloring book kind of thing for whenever we can go back to restaurants. <laughs> we haven't been out to eat and with the boys in months. Okay, so now I'm in the main part, but I do have like a little pocket here in the front. So I'm gonna go through that little pocket I have toothbrush and toothpaste for the boys, just in case they stay the night somewhere. I like to just keep it in the book bag. I have a little baby wash. I don't know why. Why do we need that? I have some butt paste. I don't even remember the last time I've used butt paste on him, on Aaron. Here is some sunscreen. Um, just a little stick sunscreen. This is not very malleable. It's just kind of stiff and hard to work into the skin, so it's not my favorite. This is the Honest Company brand. 
Oh, I also have some panty liners just in case because this is mom's book bag as well as the boys. <laughs> okay, so that's all the junk. <laughs> now let's get into the actual diapers and stuff. So let's see here. I have one pair of little boxer brief underpants for Aaron. I have two, three more wet bags. So that's a total of four wet bags right now. That's not necessary. <laughs> I have a flip um, training pants cover with an insert in there, plus two more inserts to go with that. So I have my full tr my full flip training pants set in the diaper bag. I also have this Thirsties um, cover with two. These are the intermediate size Green Mountain diapers pre folds inside there. Not that I would use them both together, but just to keep them kind of organized inside of the diaper bag. I just put the both of them together. Oh look, another wet bag. <laughs> I have some uh, just disposable pampers or huggies or whatever wipes inside of this little container. Um, that's just what we do for on the go. We always bring like wipe wipes instead of cloth wipes. I have my training or my, oh, what was I gonna say? I have my changing pad here, which my mother made me. It rolls all up into a little little doodad, and it has a little pocket in this top part. And inside of this little pocket, I have a random diaper liner and a like old school thin crappy prefold. I don't even know where it came from. It must have been like a hand-me-down and some something. And a little bit of Honest Company diaper cream, just in case. This is looking like a mess down here. Okay, I have some chocolate Teddy Grahams inside of a snack container. That's important, need that. Oh my God, guys, another freaking wet bag. <laughs> okay, I have some shorts for Aaron, some underpants for Aaron, shorts for Calvin, um, a shirt for Aaron and a shirt for Calvin some socks. I don't even remember the last time the boys wore socks because it's summertime and we just live in sandals all summer. And then down the bottom I had this little like, I don't know if you call it like a first aid or just like random little important things to have like nail clippers and kids Tylenol and whatever else is in here. I don't even know. There's like packets of things. Alcohol wipes, stuff like that just in case. Oh, there's more stuff down here. Oh my gosh, there's more diapers. Here's another disposable. Here, oh, here's some cloth wipes. I totally forgot I put those in there. Cloth wipes in there. Um, another pack of disposable wipes. <laughs> okay. And that's it. That's everything that was inside the bag. Now I need to decide what I'm going to get rid of and what I'm not going to get rid of. This is the hard part. Oh, and here's a hat. There's a little sun hat in there. I don't even remember the last time Aaron wore this, but, you know, when you have tiny babies, they need hats, right? This is hard. I'm really, like, an overpacker, so this is going to be hard to decide what I'm going to not put back in the bag. <laughs> well, first of all, we can, we can take all of these wet bags and we can probably narrow this down right we don't need like five wet bags maybe i should get a better system going on here so all this coming down okay i am going to keep one wet bag in the bag i'm gonna put the little first aid kit thing in there. It's not like first aid, but whatever. The little thing that's going in there. All of this, the two prefolds in the cover, staying out. The flip system, staying out. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. I really want to kind of keep one diaper in there, but I'm not gonna do it. <laughs> okay. These underwear, I'm pretty sure, are dirty. They look like they've been like sat in, in something dirty. So those are dirty. Those could not go back in the bag. So Shorts for Aaron, underwear for Aaron, shorts for Calvin, 
I guess we'll just throw the socks back out. Like, why do we need socks right now? Should I leave the socks? I really should do this seasonally. We could probably cut down on a lot of things if I did this seasonally. So, okay, even though I don't want to, I'm going to leave the socks out and put... I'm actually going to leave these shirts out, too. They don't need extra shirts. Uh, sometimes we go over to my mom's and they want to get into my sister's pool or they want to get into my mom's hot tub. And sometimes they just might need extra shirts. So I'm going to keep the extra shirts. So I have shorts, underwear, shorts, shirt, shirt. Snacks. Snacks are going to stay in. All of these wipes I'm not going to keep in because I have these wipes, which I actually, these wipes, which I actually need to like consolidate into one container here. You know, I don't know what we're going to do with these wipes, just in case there's an accident or something, or maybe just like when they're dirty. When I have dirty handed children, we'll need wipes. So putting those back in, putting the other wipes container up there. This teeny tiny crappy little prefold is going to stay inside of my changing pad because it's kind of a nice little pillow when you lay baby down, even though like, you know, I don't know. I don't know, okay? I might need to lay Aaron down at some point. <laughs> All these disposables, I don't know what I'm gonna do with them, but they're not staying in the bag. I have two butt creams. I'm only gonna keep one. I'm just gonna keep this stuff and I'm gonna put that, um, Oh look, I found another mask. Ooh, I found two new masks. What the heck? My mom has made us a lot of masks. My mom enjoys sewing and the like creative things. So she's made everyone in our family like one million masks. So there's some of our masks. Toothbrush and toothpaste. I am putting back in there just in case for when they stay the night somewhere. I'm gonna put my little panty liners back. I'm gonna put my Excedrin that I can't live without, these little uh, wipey doodads, our um, sanitizing wipes, what else? Um, my sunglasses go in the front pocket. I'm gonna put this little toy in the front pocket just in case. Butt paste is gonna go in the front lower pocket along with sunscreen. Hand san the big hand sanitizer. Small hand sanitizer is gonna go in a side pocket. Sunglasses for the boys are both going to go in the top front pocket where my sunglasses are. I think that'll be good. I am going to keep these random Walmart bags because just in case. This hat takes up like no space, so I'm just gonna throw it in there as well. I'm gonna put that in the front bottom pocket. And this little play booklet thingy is gonna go in there too. I'm also gonna throw this tiny sunscreen in there just in case I lose the other sunscreen. I don't know, you never know, right? Maybe I should take this to my purse. I don't know. Okay, so if I was heading out of the house right now, I would also put my wallet in there. So that's a lot of space. There's like nothing going on inside this bag now. And it weighs pretty much the same, I think. But it's not as fat, it's like much tinier. So all the things that I took out are all over there. So I'm actually kind of happy with myself. I'm kind of proud of myself for actually minimizing some things inside of this bag. I really would like to get down to a point where I'm like only bringing like, you know, just extra shorts for the boys just in case they have an accident like in my purse like that would be awesome if I could just take my own purse everywhere and just have like a pair of pants for each one of them inside the purse I know I could get away with that like I said I'm just such an overpacker it's just stupid <laughs> so I hope this video was at least a little bit helpful for you guys I don't know was it entertaining in any way that it's been like 17 minutes this has taken me a while <laughs> to do this so i hope you guys enjoyed the video i hope it was at least entertaining in some way for you guys if you liked it don't forget to give it a thumbs up let me know about your struggles with overpacking in the diaper bag and i'll talk to you guys next time bye